I was getting ready to do this, I was starting to get information in the shower. Specifically, what I was feeling was a maternal energy. So I don't know if you were really, really hoping to hear from your mom. I know you have a son that's passed. Yes. Um, but I, I feel your mom very strong. Yes. And I'm being told to tell you from her that the mother that I couldn't be to you, I was to your son. Is there a connection to you personally being friends with, like, Marilyn Monroe? Yes. For real? Yes. Like you knew her, knew her? She was a, a close friend of mine. I asked Marilyn to back up for me that you actually really do have this connection. She's telling me that you have something of hers. It's just a photo of you guys having coffee, or it's a, it's a snapshot of, of you, but it's like private and personal, it's not yes. publicized. And it's just her way of letting you know, like, it's me and I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Now, when, yours, when your son passed, before he passed, the day before, did you guys have a special lunch or a special, like a special, um, I'm going to say like an eating experience? Well, actually, I cooked spaghetti for him. Was it not something that was a regular thing, so if you did it, it would be a special meal? You could say that. <laughs> okay, because he's making me feel like I have fond memories of that lunch. I have fond memories of, of this. And I know that when he passed, you were not clearly expecting that. But I feel like I need to acknowledge for you that this was not something spontaneous. Of course, we don't know, but I think it may have had, had something to do with sleepwalking. Because he clearly did, you know, he did not know what he was doing. I don't feel like his intention was to end his life, but I do feel like he has to take the responsibility. But I think that there was a buildup to it. I want you to know that his father's passed. Yes. I want you to know that he's with his dad. They're together. So. Wyatt is Anderson's father and has a, has a, we could say, sarcastic, funny sense of humor? Well, not sarcastic, but very witty. Okay. Like, uh, like his son, Anderson. Okay. Well, I'm going to tell you that his father, <laughs> if this is him, um, is, he's definitely, he's being a, I would call him being a chop buster. So I feel like I'm supposed to, to bring this up. I'm also supposed to talk about somebody being an accomplished either uh, celloist or an accomplished violinist. or yes. who, who is this? No, I was uh, married to Leopold Stokowski, who was a, a conductor. Has he passed? Yes. Well, Wyatt is acknowledging that he's got with him the person who's an accomplished person when it comes yes. to the music, like yes. the violinist, yes. the celloist. Yes. But um, I want you to know that the son that's passed is with your family, mom, dad, his dad, your uncle's father who passed. I know you know that, Yes. but I feel like it's my job to kind of help let you know that. Do you still have Carter's t-shirt? Yes. Okay, because he's telling me to talk about the T-shirt. And um, I, I don't know if you have a wall of him, if he's got a whole wall, like if you dedicated a wall to him, that's well, just his wall. Well, I have a wall. wall with, you know, wonderful photographs of him and paintings he's done. And, uh, Is there a one with a Disney connection on it? <sighs> no, I don't like think if, so. If you look at this wall, I see, the, I see something Disney. So there's something about Disney that I'm supposed to bring up. Well, we had a wonderful trip to Disney, Disneyland in Florida. With him? With Anderson and Carter and Wyatt, yes. Well, he's telling me to bring up the, the photo yes. of that. Yes. So there's something about that that he, he's, he's, he's bringing up.